Yo, what's up guys? Today we'll be showing you guys how to use Griffin. So right now we have Griffin actually ready set up for a reincarnation for la from the last video, previous video that we did with Griffin. So <coughs> reincarnation buffs 100%. That's why Griffin is doing 500% as well. This is Griffin's second form, which is um, Darkness, which allows him to do a full AoE damage with 6.4 seconds. But it could get even stronger, by the way. This unit could get even stronger. So let's place another Griffin down. So let's speed a Skull Knight. Let's speed a Skull Knight. Oh, that's too much. So you don't want to go at 100% because it's weaker. So let's sell that. Let's try to do that again. This time, let's not fully upgrade it. That's only 35%. Damn, I did too much. So you gotta worry about like doing it too much, guys. Because you could go even higher than that. You could go even higher than 100% as you saw previously. There we go. I Six. Ninety-six. Ninety-seven. <laughs> ninety-nine. All right, we have ninety-nine. So now we just wait. Just build up everything now. Build up everything that we have. Now this unit is so costly. Now this unit is super costly, dang. So in the meantime, while we wait for more money, we could also do the Orin buff. Um, so if we do the Orin buff with uh, this check Skull Knight, because we can't do, uh, we can't buff, um, we can actually cannot buff um, Griffin, because he is actually a magic unit, and Orin only buffs um, physical damage. So let's go and buff. So you see how um do you see how Skull Knight gets uh twenty five percent? That's twenty five percent ahead of its uh I messed up. Uh but But like you see that twenty five percent? That's twenty five percent up on top of the hundred percent that you're receiving from um, Griffin's reincarnation, which is actually just insane. By the way, that's that's absolutely just insane. Like that's just insane. Like you know, you you gotta be able to hit over one million damage with like any unit. That's like half decent at this point. So you definitely want to get Griffin, guys. want to get griffin and um yeah at least you know the this reincarnation buff at least is just uh you know it's a passive buff so you don't have to do any interactions while well, you have to do interactions with this unit so let's do this again all right so this time we've actually set it up So now we wait for the buff to finish to see the full buff. This takes a while by the way. Always takes a while to set up full buff. Especially when you're using Orin. Orin is kind of the weakest buffer. It takes him like 3 cycles before he gets the full buff. <laughs> so you currently see his 800k. That's with the 25% buff. So let's see it when it's 100% buff. Sadly, we cannot buff um, Griffin because we didn't bring Leafy. We brought um, a physical team instead. So we just gotta wait and see. Wait and see. 95%. So it's 95% is 1.2 mil. Without the Griffin buff, it's losing 100% buff, by the way. It's losing 100% of its damage right there. 100% of, like, you know, the 200%. Uh, that. Excluding the normal damage. So 
So now this is 100%. And there we go, 100%. 1.2.8 mil instead of 1.21 mil is now 1.28 mil, which is extremely high, by the way, extremely, extremely high. All right, let's place down one more guts. So the more that the more stuff you feed to your griffin, the more stuff you feed to your griffin, the more damage it does. By the way, so let's go and uh, let's go and sell this off now. Sell the buff off because we're not gonna keep the buff because uh, this is gonna be griffin only. So let's feed it. 494% You see how much stronger it is from um, this griffin? 200% more stronger. This is only 243% This is like 498% So yeah, the more units you feed to your um, um, or, um, griffin, the more damage it does It really depends on the cost though It really does. It really does just depend on the cost and how much you feed it so you should, like bringing in more expensive units would definitely increase the damage of um, Griffin, but it'll be harder to um, level up. So yeah. Um, by the way, um, reincarnation is usually the form you want to get. Reincarnation is the form you want to get because it gives 100% buff as well as pretty easy to hit compared to um, compared to um, darkness. So darkness is usually just used more often for infinite mode. Um, Griffin Reincarnation is hella meta for tournaments. In fact, if you don't bring um, Griffin Reincarnation in um, in tournaments, you're not winning. You're not you're not getting past top fifty. I'll, I'll, I'm just gonna say that you're just not getting past top fifty. I don't know how you would like you're, like the hundred percent buff is with stacking with um, Orin or Leafy or Winda if you're if you're like you know budget if you don't want to like build it like for some reason even though if you're like a whale you're not still not building it like okay bro. <laughs> But yeah, yeah, definitely. This is the first form you want to get. Griffin Darkness is only for if you're doing um, if you're doing um, Infinite Mode. Reincarnation is useful useful for every mode you're trying to do. So yeah, guys, that is pretty much it um, for how to use Griffin. Um, I'll see you guys next time for another anime adventure video. In the meantime, have a good day, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace out.